we have is important, okay? That's what this ring means. We're special for each other. Look, Scott, this ring also means that I'm 18. And I'm capable of making my own decisions. I don't want to be treated like a little kid anymore. Oh, it's a good thing I came up and not Vince. Uh, wait. Excuse me, I better see how my other guests are doing. Okay. I know how difficult this is for you. Difficult? That's not the word. Well, if you need a friend, I'm here. Remember that. Thank you. Come on, let's get this party started. Yeah, yeah, come on. You look so beautiful. Thank you, Mama. I love the dress. You do. Why do I suddenly feel so old? <laughs> I guess mommies are supposed to feel that way when their babies are all grown up like these two. Mm. I figured that was it. I thought so, yes. Happy birthday, sweetheart. Thanks, Lisa. This is really my day. Mm -hmm. And Dick? Um, Adam says you got some kind of a letter. Do you think that Pop looks all right? Yeah, he looks fine. And Dick, I think he's having a really hard time with Mama here. Well, they're both having a hard time, but they have to get through this. I wish you I think I'd better go check and make sure he's all right. MJ, is you? Any luck? Just changing the subject. Listen, I gotta get back downtown. They just, uh, precincts call me back down there. Would you keep on here and see if you can find out what's going on? Oh, I'll do my best. She will talk to you in a way that she won't talk to me. Uh, I'm not so sure about that. I am. Just stay on it, will you? And call me. Well, you are finally 18, kiddo. <laughs> and no matter what they say, you're still the last of my litter, so you're always gonna be my baby. Uh. <laughs> now, I admit that I was... Well, a little upset when I heard you left uh, the nun. Oh, yeah. Okay, 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 I blew my fuse. Uh -huh. <laughs> and I admit also that I thought of sending you back. But I'm certainly glad I didn't. Because this is where you belong. Happy birthday, girl. I'm so proud of you. Listen, I'm going to have to go back downtown. Are you going to be all right? Yeah, I'm going to be fine. Take some cake. Oh, great. Yeah. Okay. Stop worrying. Just go back to work. I'd like to propose a toast. First, I'd like to say how very happy I am to be here. Very such an important occasion. And to my family. I wish I could have been here for all my children's birthdays. But I feel as though I've been given a second chance with you. And I can't begin to tell you how that makes me feel. I'm so sorry for all the years we lost. And I would give anything to be able to change that. But I can't. So I'm just going to be happy that we're together now. I am so proud to see that my littlest girl, with the help of her father, has turned into such a lovely young woman. The role of Gomez is now being played by Stephanie Martini. Gomez, I want Vince McKinnon out of Mary's life. We found a man who looks enough like Mr. McKinnon. Once we rehearse him a little, we should be ready to put the plan into execution. See to it, Gomez. I can't wait much longer. Oh. 
If Cass and Kathleen hadn't been holding the family together, I don't know what would have happened. Yeah, they're pretty terrific, all right. Yeah. You must be feeling pretty uncomfortable, I mean, staying with them. They're technically still on their honeymoon. Well, they've been wonderful to me, but I'm starting to feel that I shouldn't be there. They need some privacy. Hey, that's a perfect reason for you to move in with me. You're going to start that again, hey? Yeah, I am. I mean, I don't know what I have to do to convince you. I certainly have given you enough chances to back out of this. Ah, does that mean yes? Are you sure that you think oh, this is a good idea? Yes. I keep telling you, I'm going stir-crazy in that great big apartment. Come on. It'll do us both a lot of good. Okay, why not? Ah, terrific. Here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Happy birthday, Joe. Thanks. Thanks, all you guys. Feels really good to be 18. <laughs> Pop? Mama? Please. Mama. Let it go, Sarah. Since it is my birthday, I'd like both my parents to be together. Even if it is only for a night. All those years I, I grew up without a mother. I, I don't mean to blame you or anything, you know, but uh, now you're here and you and Pop can't even talk to each other. Now, sweetie, this is kind of tough for Mary and Vince. I know all that, okay? Well, no, back off. It's my birthday and uh, I think I ought to get at least one wish. Well, why don't you tell us what it is? A picture. With, with both of you. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure that's such a hot idea. Please, Pop. It, it would mean a lot to me. Oh, I ask your mother. Mama? I'd be very proud to be in here. <laughs> Terrific. Come on. Well, I have a camera right here. So why don't you guys get over here? <laughs> over where? By the wall. Okay. By the wall, Mr. Pendleton. By the wall. And Cheryl in the middle. You guys put your arms around her. Keep them tight. Okay. That's great. Are you guys going to smile? Isn't that it's beautiful together? It's a real family. Do you think there's any way that my mama and pop could just find a way back to each other? You know my motto. There's always hope. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, one more, you guys. Why would anyone want to deliberately hurt Donna? You'll be pleased to know that we're set to put the plan for Vince McKinnon into operation. I could use some good news, Gomez. Everything will be ready, Senor Love. I may have lost my daughter, but I won't lose Mary. I'm going to get her back. I've decided to take Felicia up on her offer and move in with her. Mama, you don't have to do that. Yes, I do. Well, then you can stay with us as long as you need to. Yeah, we're going to be going on our honeymoon very soon, and the whole place will be empty. You have both been wonderful to me, and I love you for it. But I'm starting to feel I should get out on my own. Mm. Mama, are you sure about this? Oh, absolutely. I want to see if I can make it on my own. Okay. You know, as a lawyer, I've got to tell you, you've got a real good personal injury suit against Redmond. Yeah, Cass is right. If you want to sue that guy, you could really take him to the cleaners. No, I don't want anything from my dad. We really look good together. Oh, you look pretty good yourself. Too bad they had to be split up. It's bad when anyone splits up, even my dad and your mom. Yeah, but he deserved it. Maybe, but still hurt her a lot. I guess it was pretty tough all around. 
When people decide to get together, they have to know what they're doing. Maybe they just have to be committed to each other. Don't you think we're ready for that? Great story. Don't we look really good together? Yeah, it's a, it's a nice picture. Pop, could you uh, take a picture of me? What? Is that face of yours? You break the camera. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. Come on, Scott. Sure. Okay, I think we're ready. Uh, MJ, why don't you get in a picture? No, no. I'd really just like to have us two in it. Oh, wait a minute. Hold out my hand so we can get my ring in it, okay? When did you get that? Oh, that's pretty. That's a pretty present. Thanks. I should take a picture of your beautiful daughter. Yeah, just go ahead. Just snap away. Pop, isn't it beautiful? 